It's all part of our Wish Tree toy drive, and this morning we're teaming up with the Colts and the Salvation Army. Of course, Wish TV personalities will be there throughout the day collecting toys. One of the biggest personalities, of course, our Dick Wolsey is live down there. <laughs> Dick, good morning to you. Uh, getting things started bright and early, 7.04 this morning. Well, that's, that's a heck of an introduction. I'm glad you feel that way. <laughs> hey, I have so many cool things to tell you this morning. We are out at the, the famous... Um, Hertz Bean Lot, which is on the south side of Lucas Oil Stadium, and here's what's happening today in general. First of all, I'm sort of going to start backwards. Uh, between 11 and 1 today at all uh, uh, entrances to all gates to Lucas Oil Stadium, you can bring an unwrapped new toy for a youngster, and all of the Channel 8 personalities, because there are a few others, will be there giving out the toys. In fact, I won't be there because I already got up at 6 in the morning and I don't have to do it now. But everybody else will be there. That will be very cool. But you also have an opportunity this morning to come down here to the uh, to the uh, uh, the bean lot on the south side of Lucas Oil Stadium and bring a toy. And look, we have somebody already. Good morning. You didn't want to be on TV, did you? Not really. You didn't really. Well, that's kind of too late. What's your name? Vicky. Okay, Vicky. Thank you very much for bringing some Play-Doh and some other toys. And if you would come a little later... You could have gotten from this guy. Oh, oh she's going to get one? Okay. Here, Joe Drazda. Tell hi, Joe. Good morning, Joe Drazda. One of the right. professional tailgaters. Tell us what you're giving Vicky. A free Johnsonville sausages. Look at that. Good stuff. Is that good stuff? That's good stuff. And if you'd come a little later, he'd have cooked one for you. But you just got here too early. Might have to come back. You know, okay, that's good. Hey, we're Joe. Um, Joe draws to the uh, Tailgater's Handbook. He's setting up here, and he's going to be cooking. So if you come down with an unwrapped new toy, Joe will not only give you a coupon for Johnsonville Bratz, but he will cook you a little bit breakfast. I think he's doing um, uh, chicken wings. And uh, we have a couple of other special gifts for you. So that's this morning for the next couple of hours. And with me is uh, Nick Montgomery, captain at the Salvation Army. Captain, good morning, sir. Good morning to you. It's great to be with you. Tell us a little bit about how you guys have been doing this year so far. How's it going? Well, things are going uh, pretty well. We're about 30% of our goal. Mm -hmm. And... Uh, and we're confident we're going to reach our goal. we got a great goal of $3.3 million uh, overall, and uh, things are just looking good. Terrific, and I want to clarify that we, do, we would like people to come down today to the various gates, but you will be collecting toys at various locations, wishtv.com for that list, and where can you, um, uh, and so people can distribute until, until what year, yeah, what year and what time, December 14th? Uh, well, our distribution is up is, is the 20th. Oh, up to the 20th. Up to the 20th. Yeah. And so uh, we, we need all the toys we can get. We, we've collected about a, th a couple thousand toys, but we, we have over 2,400 kids that we have to give toys to. We want to we wanna, we wanna bring a smile to their face, and so we need all the help that we can get. So uh, up until the distribution, and uh, we're going to be distributing those uh, toys to those kids at the fairgrounds. Uh, so uh, yeah, they, now this is something that you do every year, which is very cool. But very quickly, uh, uh, right now it is not available because you have to do a signing up process. But for for next year and the future, you can reach the Salvation Army and get more information. But that's terrific. But once again, toys here this morning up until nine o'clock. Toys between uh, eleven and one at all gates here at Lucas Oil Stadium. And come on down this morning, get some free food. Just bring a toy, a very special toy for a special youngster. Back to the studio. All right, Dick Wilson live for us this morning. Thank you. We'll be checking in with you throughout daybreak. It's all part of our Wish Tree Toy Drive, and this morning we're teaming up with the Colts. Dick Wolsey is live across the street from Lucas Oil Stadium. He's been collecting toys all morning, and he's also been eating some breakfast sausage. Dick. See now, Walter, in the last segment, you called me a personality, and obviously you didn't do it this time, so you must have had a call from management. No, I had knocked that off. <laughs> is that, no, seriously, is that what happened? No, that is not what happened. All right, John, just check. You, 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 you are a personality, yeah. the personality, yeah. sir. <laughs> no, there you go. All right. Hey, here's a personality, Joe Drossett, the Tailgaters Handbook, who has been talking about tailgating for, what, 10, 12 years, haven't you? Since 1996. Since 1996. And let's see, one of the things I love, the reason I love to have you on the show is, first of all, Joe is here, of course, because he wants to help us uh, get toys for kids, which you can do here at Lucas Oil Stadium up until 9 o'clock, and then at all the gates from for the game between 11 and 1 with the Channel 8 personalities, just bring back, uh, bring, uh, bring over an unwrapped toy but you always have such neat gadgets what have you got this morning well this is a kitchen range uh, I need to turn this burner yeah. off I okay. left it on but we're cooking biscuits in here mm -hmm. then we're gonna cook sausage and eggs for all of our assembled crowd right over here we're making coffee as we speak in fact it's probably ready and all of these items are of course available in the stores this is a Coleman yeah 
propane coffee maker and a Coleman range. Mm -hmm. And are you ready for some coffee? Yeah, well, wait a second. I want to look at your bratwurst here. Step over here a second. We got we're, we're, Bill Hicks, who's producing yeah. some bratwurst. Uh, Bill Broth. Right. And Tell us about that, so, about that stove. You can, that's, a, that's a neat stove, too. By the way, that's a uh, Road Trip Grill. That's the new one by Coleman. And it has enough BTUs. It's just as good as one of those gas grills you'd have on the patio. Really cool. Yeah, it's uh, it's strong and it folds up and you just wheel it away. Now here's the deal. Everybody listen carefully to this. If you come down to the Hearst lot uh, up until about nine o'clock, Joe will either give you a, or maybe both a uh, a sample of the bratwurst and a coupon. Is that right? Oh yeah, and we've yeah. got Frank's Red Hot Hot Wings. You're right. That. Um, they were made up by uh, Fresh Market, and we're going to have those to give away as well. Now, I understand you can do something else with the bratwurst. Can you do something? Well, believe it or not, yeah. not just the bratwurst, but the Johnsonville sausage. Yeah. You're right. They made bean soup with it. Not Hearst? Not Hearst? Made bean soup. Where we have Hearst bean soup. Right? Where is he? Wait, he's over here. Okay, your name just, your name just, Rick Hurst, just casually came up in conversation. Just casually. I don't know if that's good. Yeah, and that's good because uh, uh, Drosden mentioned bean soup. Do you know anything about bean soup? I know a little bit about bean soup. Yeah, we have a little bit of around here. Show me, show me, okay. show me. Okay, all right. Well, we've got, uh, usually people relate us to our 15 bean soup, which is a, a very popular item. But this morning, we, what we have for you is one of our Hearst family lentil products. And uh, it's got Johnsonville sausage in it. Um, and uh, uh, it's been uh, simmering here for uh, a little while, and it's ready, hot and ready to yeah, go. This is not a secret, is it? Because I, I, this is not. This is a brand new item. Oh, okay. exactly. Because, see, yeah. I, all this stuff, this other company, all this yeah. secret stuff. I don't. That's a bunch of baloney. I want. We want to share our. our, right. our, our all right. Can I taste right. it? Absolutely. Yeah. Taste it. There we go. Oh, it's nice and hot here. So. Oh boy. Oh, we've. Goodness. we've uh, uh, We've made it. It's got a little carrots, a little onion in it. Uh, it's got Johnsonville sausage. Oh, and lentils are one of those uh, items that cook in about 20 minutes. So it's uh, it's very quick. Um, and the, uh, it's got... Uh, oh, that is good. What, a, what a great morning to have that. There's nothing better than, than beans in the morning. If you come down and we have a little leftover of the soup, Absolutely. we will definitely have brats and sausages. And we will also have uh, coupons, and I got some signed books for people, so come on down by 9 o'clock this morning. This is the South Lot, the Beanhurst Lot, and we'll be able to take care of you, bring an unwrapped toy, and of course you can see Channel 8 personalities um, today between uh, uh, 11 and 1, right before the big game. So come on, uh, come on down and enjoy yourself and bring an unwrapped toy for a special kid. Back to you, Walter. All right, Dave, we'll see you live for us this morning. you got to make sure our photographer, David Hodge, gets some food, too. You're dragging him all over the place. We'll check back <laughs> in with you uh, the rest of the morning, 739. We'll be right back on the other side. It's all part of our Wish Tree Toy Drive. Uh, this morning, we're teaming up with the Colts and the Salvation Army. Dick Wolsey is live downtown at Hurst you know, Bean Nick, Field, right I across the street. This, so I don't have to run and, all uh, Yes, Dave. Hey, Dick, I'm introducing you. you got to wait for me to introduce oh. you before you start talking. Oh. Were you talking to me? Yes, I was introduced. Well, why are you talking to me? <laughs> you talking to me? You talking to me? See, like I said earlier, Sorry. the biggest personality we have right here, Dick Wolsey. Right. And the most hard of hearing, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> hey, thank you, Walter, very much. Uh, nothing has changed doing the show in 30 years. I'm still paying no attention to anything. Okay, Nick Montgomery, I paid attention to you, didn't I, sir? Captain, yeah. good morning, sir. Good morning. Good morning. With the salvation, of course. We're so pleased that you're here, and we admire all the great work that you've done here in Indianapolis. And tell us what's happening. Uh, it's just today and in general with the Salvation Army this holiday season. Well, we're here at Lucas Oil. We're trying to collect uh, toys for for a lot of needy kids. In fact, over 2,400 uh, kids uh, who are in need of uh, uh, of smiles and toys uh, for Christmas. And so we're all here collecting uh, toys at all the gates and entrances. And uh, we're looking for as many people to come out and help us out. Terrific. And you can do that um, all this week and next week uh, at various locations, which you can see at wishtv.com. But this morning until uh, 9 o'clock, I will be down here. We're going to be we're, we're doing some cooking. You can get, uh, if you bring a toy, an unwrapped toy, you'll get some free coupons for Johnsonville Brats, a couple of free books from me, and uh, just have a good time. And then from 11 to 1 at all gates here at Lucas Oil State, Channel 8 personalities will be here to collect those toys as well. Thank you, Captain. Good, good, to, good to see you. Rick Hurst, good morning, sir. Good morning. Good morning. Uh, you, I want you to stay right there. Yep. 
I'm just sort of directing. I'll be right back. I need to talk to you about something very important, okay? Rick Hurst, Hurst being live. Hey, Joe Drosden. Good morning, sir. We just have literally 15 seconds. What are you cooking up here? Sausage, egg, and cheese biscuits on this little Coleman range. Terrific. And I'm having hot coffee here. Joe Drosden, professional tailgater, has been doing tailgating for how many years? Yeah. Since... Since 1980. Terrific. Okay. Thank you, sir. And if you come by, you got some uh, coupons and some food, right? Right. right. We're going to feed everybody with Frank's Red Hots and Johnson Bills. Terrific. All right. Now, here's the, the little problem we have. Rick, come over here. Uh, this is this is uh, Mike. Uh, good morning. No, this is Charlie. No, this is Mike. This is Mike. This is Mike. But your friend Charlie, he's the trouble. <laughs> You're going to give a toy. Mm -hmm. Okay. So you can do that right away. Give a toy. Give a toy. Very good. Now, your problem is that you have a friend who's very skeptical of everything. This is true. Is this true? Yes, it now, is. You're not going to believe what he doesn't believe. What does, what does your friend not believe? Charlie, what does Charlie not believe? He doesn't believe that there's 15 beans in a 15 bean uh, package. package. Do you ever get this? No, I, get that, I get that on a regular basis. People I, call yeah, 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 they, yeah, they ask all the time. Yeah, they, or is it really 15 different beans? Yeah, 15 different beans, yes. Yeah. Excuse me one second. There you go. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> what are you doing? I'm making sure there's 15 beans soup in here. So, no one's ever done this. Nobody cares about this. Really. There's 15 beans on the bag. You're not a professional bean counter, are you? No. You're not. Right. Thank God. There are 15 beans, I know, because Rick Hurst would never lie to you about something like that. Come on down. You've got till 9 o'clock here this morning to give a toy, and again, between 11 and 1 at all the different gates at Lucas Oil Stadium before the big game. Okay, back to the studio. All right, Dick, I'm going to get yelled at for asking you this question, but uh, really quickly, if you can't buy a toy, you can drop on some cash or a check. Oh, why would you get in trouble for that question? No, absolutely. We're running out of time. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> no, yes, you can. Yes, you can. Okay, uh, really quickly. All right, uh, so drop off some cash or a check. Yes, absolutely. Out there uh, to drop off a toy. We'll be right back. Stay with us. Welcome back to the last half hour of Daybreak Sunday. It is 828, December 9th. You are looking at live pictures of our wish tree toy drive that is going on right now. It is actually across the street from Lucas Oil Stadium, but then it's going to uh, progress to the stadium. A lot of Wish TV personalities are going to be at the gates collecting new unwrapped toys. And of course, you have until the 20th, the Salvation Army said this morning, you have until the 20th to drop off a new unwrapped toy, or they'll take donations in the form of cash or a check. So uh, if you can't make it out to uh, one of the stores to get a toy, just drop off some money. Yeah, we hope to see you at Lucas Oil Stadium. Absolutely. Can't the be there? Yeah. Yep. Big personalities, can't be there? Yeah, no, no. <laughs> Toys for children in need. It's all part of our Wish Tree Toy Drive. This morning, we're teaming up with the Colts and the Salvation Army. Dick Wolsey is live downtown at Hearst Bean Field, right across the street from Lucas Oil Stadium. And it's right off McCarty Street, uh, Dick Wolsey, if I'm correct. Uh, if we can send it out to him. Is he with us? Yes. Good morning. Good morning. Hey, um, good morning. We are, we are looking at Lucas Oil Stadium, and uh, we are here, of course, on the south side of the Hearst Bean Lot, and we're also looking at Rick Hurst. Wave good morning, Rick. Good morning. Good morning, good morning. And uh, we are here collecting toys. We're going to be here till about 9 o'clock, and with Captain Montgomery with the Salvation Army, and uh, I'll help you say this because I talk quicker than you. Bring a toy, buy a wrap toy, and it'll go to a special child here in the Indianapolis area. And uh, how are you doing in general with your uh, with the fundraising and everything? We're doing really well. Uh, we're, we're right now we're about 30 percent, and uh, we're going to make it. We're confident that we are. Terrific, and uh, you can drop toys off today, 11 to 1, a wrap toy or a donation. And, of course, you can do it at the Salvation Army as well. And about, oh, I think 12 or 14 locations around Indianapolis, which you can see at wishtv.com. Absolutely. I did most of the talking for you this time because we're a little short on time. It's Ca okay. Captain, we admire what you do. Thank you, sir. Thank you so much. And I want to also thank Joe Gerasta here, who oh. wrote the Tailgators Handbook. And uh, what do you, well, I, hope you're, you're, I hope you're wearing pants. Yes, you are. Okay, yeah. Us. Yeah, Frank's right. We had all. You can hold it higher. We had all of these. Uh, yeah. <laughs> we had all of these hot wings, and they were prepared by Fresh Market, by the way. But they use Frank sauce, mm -hmm. and uh, we gave away hundreds of wings and hundreds of packs of Johnsonville sausages and 
everybody's having a good time down here, if but you, it's for the kids. It is for the kids, and if you come down by about 9, as Joe's packing up, there's lots of wings, there's lots of bratwurst, and uh, you can come by and take advantage of that. Please bring a wrap toy for a youngster and make it a special Christmas. Back to you guys. All right, Dick Wolsey there for another 26 minutes uh, across the street from Lucas Oil Stadium. Thank you, Dick Wolsey, a new unwrapped toy. Uh, switching gears, 8.34 the time, typically super